Looking flawless every time, everywhere is almost a must-have thing when idols appear in public. But you know, there are still times idols, especially those from famous acts, would look extremely questionable huh? just because their makeup artist didn't even know what they were doing. That sounds hard to believe because big companies are believed to pay a good chunk of money for the staff to take care of their idols. But still, things happen and not only fans, but non-fans were also triggered. <laughs> Number one, Che Hyun, Kepler. Debuting as the center of the latest girl group coming out of the latest survival show Mnet, Girls Planet 999, people always believed that Che Hyun would get the best possible treatment from the company. But since the debut of Kepler, many figured out that all the ranks held almost zero value, as beside the controversies about the center position, line distribution, and screen time distribution, Che Hyun also frequently got the most questionable makeup of the group. Back in November 2021, fans were also triggered by how carelessly the makeup of Che Hyun was done because her face looked as if she had just jumped straight out of bed five seconds prior to the photo shoot. Firstly, the eye makeup of Chaehyun looked more like two eye circles resulting from countless sleepless nights. Combining this with the brown lips color and the messy hairstyle, netizens believe Chaehyun looked more like a girl suffering from insomnia, rather than a talented visual in the teaser photo following the dreamy and 2000s concept. Unfortunately, that wasn't the only time Chaehyun's makeup artist got on the nerves of fans, because in one of the most recent fan meetings, when Che Hyun attended online, they were also upset by the way Che Hyun's makeup was done. You know how the stage lighting at music shows and in person was way stronger than normal, so idols often have to wear heavy makeup to stand out? So while it made sense for makeup stylists to literally use up the foundation container for idols when they perform on stage, that style of makeup apparently could never fit into the casual online fan meeting context. And almost right after the OP posted that photo, fans were all shook to see how a center of a well-invested girl group couldn't even have her eyebrows dyed the same color with her hair, which was also the most basic rule when doing makeup for any person with blonde hair. That was not to mention how the stylist didn't seem to understand well that Che Hyun's face fell onto the round and chubby end of the spectrum, which apparently required special contouring. So they ended up making her face look as if having two pinky chunks awkwardly sitting on the cheekbones. Not only that, people also found it confusing to see the extra thick foundation layer that was probably two shades fairer than the net caking on her face. The overdone agiosol, the lipstick that was carelessly applied under her lips, and especially the three little dots thingy on her right cheek that had nothing to do with the whole makeup. Number two, Espa's Giselle. In Espa's latest release, Dream Comes True, Giselle was said to have one of the worst makeups ever. As if putting the bare minimum effort into Giselle's eye makeup, which was easily seen through the way her eyes barely changed compared to her bare face, wasn't bad enough. The makeup artist made her face look even duller by letting her wear nude lipstick and a pair of spare eyelashes that not only looked like cucaracha legs, but also irrelevantly sat on top of her eyes. However, the main problem of this look came down to the excessively bright contact lenses that not only fiercely fought with her black hair, but also created the jarring impression that Giselle was staring straight into the soul of people rather than being a lovable idol that everyone wanted to stand, but all about portraying the Shinigami eyes. Number three, Espa's Winter. When Espa went to the stage for the performance at the 2021 Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade, they immediately became the hot topic in their hometown. However, that wasn't exactly 100% good news because people also heatedly discussed how Winter's visual looked so downgraded from her usual stunning appearance. While some blamed this on the lighting condition, Others believed it was the fault of the makeup stylists for not taking care of her visual thoroughly enough. For example, while Winter has a rather round and chipmunkish face shape, it was kind of obvious that she had zero contours to slim down the face. It also seemed like the staff put just the bare minimum effort into her eye makeup and didn't even understand her eye shapes well because with slightly protruding eyes like those of Winter, they should have chosen for her a darker shade of contact lenses rather than making her wear the same questionable ones like those of Giselle. As if that wasn't bad enough for her first public appearance in the States, Winter was even made to wear the cursed magenta pink lips color, which ended up adding ages to her 20s visual. Not only that, the unnatural, rather sticky bangs were also said to bring down the inherently stunning visual of Winter. Because instead of looking neat and professional, like the time she performed at a concert in November, some said she just looked unprepared and fed up this time. The careless makeup that Winter got that day especially triggered fans, as it was their very first appearance at the States, aka the market that SM Entertainment had poured mind and heart into conquering. So not helping Winter look her best was extremely disappointing.
maybe the staff's capabilities were negatively affected as they were feeling under the weather, because of the sudden change in time zone and climate between South Korea and the States. However, most still couldn't empathize with the careless job of the makeup artists. Number 4. Chung Ha Coming from a small company like m and Entertainment, it goes without saying that not only Chung Ha, but also the staff have always poured their heart and mind into every little thing, so that Chung Ha can get to where she is right now. However, there were still a few times when her makeup artists just couldn't do their best, and the most recent one was when Chung Ha promoted her latest single, Bicycle. Apparently, always yearning to break the boundaries for the better is good, but this time, the staff seemed to have gone a little bit too far when opting for this heart makeup for Chung Ha. When Chung Ha appeared with this makeup in the MV, where perfect lighting was set up and perfect camera angles were chosen, she looked absolutely stunning and unique. However, when she got onto the music show with the same look, some believed the thing just wasn't it because, looking from a distance, she looked as if she had been punched on the right eye. Not only that, the switch from the white gemstones' tears into the red ones was also believed to worsen the look because they legit looked like blood rolling down from the bruised right eye, creating an uncomfortable and visually unpleasing scene. Maybe she could have been better off had the makeup stylist just done her right eye makeup the same as her left one, because around that time, colorful eyeliner was sure in vogue, and considering her slightly slanted eye shape, this left eye makeup also complemented her features way better than that massive heart. Number 5. 17's Woozy In December last year, a topic suddenly went viral on Panchoa, and there, the OP complained that male idols' makeup had recently been out of hand. And the epitome of all is the appearance of Woozy when he attended the 2021 Asia Artist Awards. While it's understandable that red carpet makeup should be heavier than usual, for the camera to pick up under the extreme brightness of flashlight, people still couldn't understand how the makeup artist could throw on Woozy the foundation that was not only three shades brighter than his original complexion, but also as fair as the face of a geisha. His smoky eye makeup couldn't even be called smoky, because it legit looked like the staff just put a bunch of black powder and stuffed it on his eyes, ending up making Woozy's eyes disproportionate to the face, and even smaller than usual. The worst of all must have been the vibrant lipstick, because at the end of the day, he was still a male idol, and so a more manly and natural lip color could have done him way better than this. So do you think these makeup looks actually look as bad as how netizens reacted? Are there any other cases that I forgot to mention? Comment down below to share your thoughts with us. Also, remember to like, share, and subscribe to Be Boss TV for more interesting K-pop content. Thank you for watching.